This is Lou the Axis Grind. I'm here to talk to you about some of the modifications I've done to a stock Dunlop Crybaby GCB-95 wah pedal. Okay, one of the complaints first is that the wah is a bit shrill. So the first thing we did is we loosened this screw here and move the plastic out of the way and then there's a gear right here. What you do is you turn that about two teeth to clockwise and that gets rid of the shrillness. Also what we did is we made a couple gain changes mod here so what we did is we took and swapped resistors R15 which is the input gain resistor and then R5 which is our Q resistor okay so what happens is R15 is now 33k ohms and R5 becomes 68k and what the 33k does it gives more gain and the 68k gives more of a instead of a wah type sound, it's a wah type of sound so the best thing to do is just give a demonstration on that to show the difference and this is Lou the Axis Grind again and we have a demonstration of the Dunlop Crybaby GCB-95 wah after modification so what I have is I have a Fender Telecaster American Standard and I'm using the neck pickup right now what I've got is I've got the straight tone Do it this time is I'll kick in the wah pedal. And you notice that when I've got the pedal all the way depressed. Notice that versus the pedal out. You Note know, there's a slight bit of more gain there with the pedal all the way depressed and kicked in. And what the cue does is it actually allows for the tone to be a little bit more sudden towards the end there. If you use a, a lower value for the Q resistor for R5, like the stock value of 33,000, it's a more gradual type of wah. This is like a funky style wah. Mm -hmm. 